Hello from Cambridge. Today is the first day of the Head of the Charles Regatta. This iconic Boston sports event is not only for the hundreds of competitors coming from all over the country and the world, but it's also a great recruiting event to grow the rowing community. The Head of the Charles Regatta is a three-day event filled with competition, food, and different divisions welcoming people of all ages and experience. Charlotte Coop, a competitor for the Station L Rowing Club, agrees. I mean, this is the biggest regatta in the world, so everyone's really excited just to be a part of it. And um, whether or not you know you've been rowing for a year or for 50, like it, it's just so inclusive of everybody that I think that's it, that's what makes the hype. Coop is also the coach for Pacific University's rowing team. My team isn't here this year, but I'm also using this time to recruit for um, my college. On the other hand. Maggie Ward, a senior at Camp Randall Rowing Club, is using the regatta to seek out participating colleges to ensure her involvement in rowing past her high school career. Um, it's a lot of me recruiting them a little bit, like it's all on my turf, which I really appreciate about being recruited in rowing, is I get to make a lot of the decisions. Though not all teams have the luxury to recruit, they still want to provide their students with the same experience they had as a younger rower. Ben Steele, a coach for Bastion Rowing Club in Seattle, brought his team to the regatta. I've been coming to this regatta since I was in high school, uh, and I, I went to high school on the West Coast too, and it's a great opportunity to travel and see uh, a lot of really strong competition, um, but also an opportunity for the athletes to get out of their comfort zone and race somewhere new. Fortunately, whether you are a coach or participant, rowing has become a second hobby or a meditative experience for them. Uh, what clicked with me was like the meditative feel of it and it's something that I felt like I could achieve. I love coaching. It's a, a second job for me and it's more like a hobby. Um, it's really fun to get kids in like eighth grade and then watch them change throughout high school and you know they graduate uh, five years later and you hardly even recognize them. You know, not just you know getting bigger and stronger but their personalities and how they grow as people is really fun. For Grace Pentakoff, a freshman in high school, is filled with adrenaline for participating at such a large event with people of all ages and skill level. Such an honor to be here with people that like really, really support you and support like you having this not only as a competitive experience, but also as an enjoyable experience. To find all of the results, check the head of the trials website. I'm Emily Martinez reporting from WEBN.